Swing your death metal dicks. Swinging your death metal dick. We're death metal dick swingers. Right. I um, I think we should introduce Warhound's extensive listening through in uh, Death Sember. Yeah. Let's do it. What's it going to be? Death Sember. Let's go. Right. Can, can, can we do a cool, funky intro to Death Sember? Uh, only if you are the provider. Thirty-one days of death. Nice, solid. I do. It wasn't a death yeah. riff, but what? What the fucking? It took a while for it to form. <laughs> what is this fucking art rock? <laughs> Fucking Mr. Bungle over here, alright. Sick. <laughs> I'll just overlay the last three. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thirty-one days of death. I listened to death metal. <laughs> yeah, so for thirty-one nice. days I listened to death metal as well. Yeah, and so then, it's mad. It's mental. Good anyway, all right. I guess uh, <laughs> we'll move on to the next segment. <laughs> <laughs> Thirty-one days of death. Right. I don't know where I got to because we we started talking about this list in an earlier podcast. Yeah, you got to. Yes, we probably, did. Not very uh, far in, man. Okay. I can see I, you listen to Sacred Rake though. Sacred I had. Rake, I, it's not Sacred no, Rake. No, you no. It's, it, it, right there. it's not fucking Sacred. You did this exact Sacred thing Rake. before. <laughs> it's Sacred not fucking Rake. Sacred Rake. Death metal Sacred right art, death metal. So which one are you looking at? The one with Jesus getting nailed. Is it he's not looking, Sacred Rake? He's, he's looking at... Oh my god, my it's not even getting... close. <laughs> yeah. I'm always getting phone names at Sacred Rake. I don't right. know. You, you <laughs> literally do. do it. I, I'm putting both of these in, in both of those episodes, but you've done this exact same thing <laughs> twice. <laughs> Fuck me. He's going to do it again. We're going to do it again next it week, mate. Yeah, but I, uh, oh, look, I can see that you've listened to fucking Sacred Rock. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It'll be when I actually listen to Sacred Rock and he's like, oh, but Ramones. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Justin Timberlake. <laughs> All right, pick some highlights out. Highlights, Caustic Wound. Cool. Uh, Death Posture, that come out this year. That's cool. really fucking good. Uh, another one that come out, I think it came out this year. It might have been, I'm saying this year. I mean 2020. Uh, Frozen Soul, Encased in Ice. I think that came out in 2020. It might have been 19. I'm not 100 percent sure on that one. Uh, I went through some of my collection that I don't listen to as often as I should as well. So yeah, I listened I to we're all guilty of that shit, man. Yeah, uh, Son Adam, Transformation. The I think it's a. The first track is called We Who Worship the Black, and it's fucking... I'm not going to pretend that I've, um, I know about this, but fair enough. It hits, it it hits all the right notes. And then we have another Van Drunen of course. masterpiece, Grand Supreme Blood Court. <laughs> That's rad. <laughs> Grand Supreme Blood Court. Yeah, it's, it's a <laughs> uh, Bow Down Before the Blood Court is the name of the album. <laughs> May, uh, <laughs> may we take a note of that and do that as an album with you and then oh wait we've got some more Van Drunen over here uh, Asphyx the Rack Hail of Bullets Six. A Frost and War and then Asphyx Death the Brutal Way yeah nice so and, that, uh, that's that's your that's your only highlights which, you want me to read all 77 because I, I like most of the albums I listen to. <laughs> oh, okay no that's fair enough so um 
77 albums and you the, you those are the ones that stand out to you the most and swallowed lunar arterial i've i've definitely yeah. noticed I, I i'm glad that they that they do swallow as well thank you I, i've it. noticed something very very vital is missing from remains your, <laughs> from your <laughs> playlist what you haven't even got vulvectomy post abortion slut fuck up there you listen to that together yeah i told you i forgot to add some stuff what what's it what's it oh, called? Uh, there's something I forgot to mention. The Mortiferum we reviewed the other week. Um, Discord by Psychotic Depths. Yeah, those guys Wait, are in what? Caustic Wound. Oh, okay, which is cool. One of the oh, highlights. I yeah, that. I think it's two of the guys are in Caustic Wound. Yeah. Sick. All right, nice one. Yeah, but this leads well, to well done, Mortiferum. Yes. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Well, while while we're doing like just rounding up your December, we should probably go to um, December. December, the December. DD, DD last year. Uh, what was album of the year? What was album? Of, oh, oh God, do we have to think about? I think we should think about that. I don't think we can make a pronouncement on that yet. Give us at least six months. <laughs> <laughs> I I wouldn't know what to say to that. Oh, to be honest, ne- it's definitely Necro. It's a high Necro Mortal. That's a highlight. That's definitely a highlight. There's so much shit coming up last year, man. You so previously did say that you, that's your album of the year that you think would be your album of the year. To be fair, I think it could be. It's the de- it's the best death metal album of the year. Oh, but there wasn't that qualifier there before. Yeah, but I, I listen to a lot of stuff. Mostly power yeah. metal and black metal. Yeah. Yeah, but there's nothing fucking wrong with that. I like European power metal, right? I like keyboards <laughs> and I like swords. All right, and dragons. Just leave me alone. Stop bullying. I like dragon. These nuts <laughs> across your face. <laughs> Stop yeah. bullying me. Me too. Yeah. With chads, power metal chads. Yeah, man. Dragging balls across faces. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Do you have anything else to say about December? Like, well, that, to, I'll be honest with you. Towards the end, um, as I said, I did really start to... It, it's difficult to just limit yourself to one genre for a month. It's not really easy. And I, I was it. very I was very religious with it. Um, it, it is good in a sense because I discovered a lot of new shit because I, I, sometimes I don't feel like I um, spend enough time with death metal, but Towards the end of it, I noticed I was I was going a lot more towards um, like Black Death because I was obviously missing black metal and I was trying yeah. to like find an excuse to get it in. Um, just my observations in how my listening habits kind of developed in that month. Um, yeah, it's hard to force yourself to listen to one thing, um, and I think I was by the end of it like I stuck to it, but I think I was beginning to miss other things yeah i know how you feel because i did i did the whole black metal in november and then yeah. i did only death metal in december it was like two months i couldn't listen to anything else i think i'd so. be all right with the black metal though black metal month because obviously i missed it um i well i did a few uh, i did like the last weekish, but i i would probably be all right with that just because just of listening habits i listen to black metal more i think i would manage but yeah i just i just started to miss other stuff yeah fair enough understandable what do you what do you reckon about that shit bag since you were listening to sacred right like halfway through december and um... <laughs> <laughs> so i love death metal but surf nicaragua <laughs> <laughs> So to be honest, I didn't. I didn't even follow Death December. Thirty-one days of death. <laughs>